Hello Geeks and Gamers, Matt Lemke here with True Gamer Goggles, and today this is uh, part of a box breaking that we started. It's the Southern Task Force deal, part three. And today we're going to take a look at the Southern Strike Force, or Southern Strike Cutter. And I don't know what, there we go. Uh, in, inside we have three block, block. Three block mambas. No, these are not the blocky guys. These are a little bit more round. These are black mambas and oh, Jaegers. Of course, you get a base for each model. Standard with all miniature games. Uh, if you've watched some of the other videos, you know, or if you're used to DreamPod 9's uh, heavy gear, you'll know that every model comes with a sprue similar to this with the basic weapons and uh, items for for the gear, the pack, the rocket launcher, combat knife, the head, and the weapon that is assigned to that model. Uh, for example, you get uh, light auto cannons, heavy auto cannons, medium auto cannons are pretty common in the game universe. Uh, in, Hopefully by now you recognize the difference between a couple of them. If you don't, you can refer to page 42 of the field manual for revised book. And obviously you've seen, if you've watched any of the other videos, you've basically seen these guys because the Jaegers are in so far every blister we've, we've looked at. Uh, clearly you can see right here that this is not a Jaeger so we're gonna, we're gonna take the time and we're gonna zoom in we're gonna go here like this that's his, his backside but that, I'm sorry yeah that's his front this is your basic uh, Jaeger for the set along with one of the weapon sprues the other Jaeger is a little bit more complicated. He has uh, legs that you have to assemble. <laughs> it would help if I showed you the right way. That was pretty sad. Something like that. He seems to be running, skating, as, as it would be put for the uh, ground mode. Then we have sets of legs for the Black Mambas. Which you're going to have to play around with just a little bit to, to get the concept of the three Black Mambas. See which legs go with which, which body. And we're gonna slide those out. Now we're gonna take a little bit of time, and we're gonna, a lot of these weapons you've already seen in the other videos, so we're not gonna go crazy. We've got the missile rocket pods, uh, medium auto cannon, light bazooka. Ooh, I think that's the uh, heavy grenade launcher, and if you, if you you know. I don't play a lot of South, and my new cult has been put together for almost two years, so you'll find me referring to page 42 of the field manual quite a bit. Uh, you've, had, you've got all your photos here, and as you can see, I'll show you in the books so you, you can you know, go right along with me. You have the medium auto cannon, you have the light bazooka, which we go over just a hand more for you. And another light bazooka. Oh, right here. Good, good examples of uh, some of the. That, is, that one right there. That's the top one. The very heavy auto cannon. Two of them. And there is a grenade launcher here. That is the heavy grenade launcher. Right there. So, in the 
strike cadre, you receive enough parts to assemble the five models that it comes with, with, with their options, uh, which, as we zoom out here a little bit, you'll get to see... all the pieces as I slide them back. Uh, the models, you know, it looks like there's really a lot of pieces to these kits, but they go together relatively easy. And you'll spend more time holding the models and letting them dry than you will trying to figure out how to assemble them. After you've put together one or two, the DreamPod 9 models pretty much just, doesn't matter what faction you play, they tend to go together the same basic way. Uh, I mean, there's a little bit of variation here and there, but there you have it. Complete contents of the Strike Force Cadre uh, that is included in the Southern Task Force deal. This has been part three of our box breaking for the, the Task Force deal. If you're watching this on our blog and you enjoyed the video and want to learn more about Heavy Gear, Grim Pod 9, and pretty much anything that we can cover in the the uh, gaming world, click on any of the social media links on your right hand side of the screen or subscribe to us on YouTube. Thanks and have a good day.